And that's why I believe he has OCD. The Christmas tree is still up. Santa Claus is coming. Hi. Yeah. Okay guys, it looks like I am actually gonna do it. Or at least try to upload as much as I can in December. I know it's a busy month, but there's also a lot happening. So I'd love to share it with you all. There's going to be days where we have events on. There's going to be days where we don't have anything on. And I'm not putting any pressure on these videos to be, you know, styled correctly or me to film in like particular ways. It's literally going to be a journal entry and... I do similar things on Instagram where I just pop up every morning and do kind of like a video journal of what's going on that day, but why not do it here? Today we have an event on. If Jacob gets dressed, we're going to go to a Christmas party that's for kids with disabilities and disadvantaged kids as well. So it's exciting. We go to this every single year. Usually it's drive through, so you've seen us previously film us driving through which actually worked out really well but this year COVID's not really a thing anymore I guess they're making it an in-person Christmas party so I'm excited for that I know Jazz is excited to see Santa Santa's making an appearance fingers crossed Jacob keeps his clothes on and we can stay at the party but I've just spent my morning sitting in front of the fridge because Jacob woke up and I had the fridge open to do some breakfast or something. Anyway, he did not want to close it. So the fridge had to remain open in his eyes. And that's why I believe he has OCD. It definitely seems to be like an OCD trait because he definitely was like freaking out that he didn't couldn't leave the fridge open because that's what it was when he first saw it. So he didn't want that change. That's it. I'm gonna go get my a treatment on my hair and when I get back, we're going to go pick the kids up and head to the Christmas party. Let me know down in the comments a Christmas tradition that you like to do. I know it's hard to do Christmas traditions, but there might be some simple ones that you guys like to do as a family. So go comment those down below. We're going to... We're going to... We're going to... And we're going to... Santa Claus is coming to our birthday. <laughs> no, it's a kid. We're going to see Santa at a Christmas party. Yeah, a Christmas party. Aren't you lucky that he's coming early just to visit before? Yeah, Christmas? I'm gonna cuddle him. Oh really? Yeah, I'm gonna cuddle him. I wanna cuddle him. I wanna cuddle him. Okay. Because he loves me. Okay, but you have to ask him first. Yeah, I will. Okay. <laughs> the Christmas tree is still up, everybody. Yay! I put that coin in. Today I went to get my hair a treatment so that it's not as frizzy. We're heading out now. We're just waiting for Jordan to get dressed Mommy, and we will go. Close your eyes. Close my eyes. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> You're trying to put something in my pocket. <laughs> Let's go! Through the show. <laughs> Doesn't matter if the snow is falling or the windows in the rain is pouring, it will always be Christmas in my heart. Santa's coming to visit No, he wouldn't miss this In Christmas times
you get, Jacob? Kids are opening their presents that they got. Jacob ready, got this ready, one. Ready. We just got back from the variety Christmas party. As always, it's such a cool experience to be a part of that. I actually cannot believe like how they put it together and it's all volunteers and it's all donated things. Like the kids got a whole Lego box set each. Like that is insane and there was so many kids there. Yeah, they got to do so many different things, mm -hmm. eat lots of food and someone had a few tears when we left because she was very overexcited about it because we don't really do things like that very often and so I think she just wanted to stay and there was other little kids that wanted to have turns on things. It gets me a bit emotional every time I go to one of those things but... Yeah, if you ever, I think they have one in Sydney, in Coffs Harbour. I, I think they have them around. So if you guys are wanting to check out the charity variety, I definitely recommend you do. Jacob ate two sausage sizzles, which was really surprising to me. But yeah, I think I'm going to end the video here. Do you want to say anything, Jazz? What was your favorite part? I think Jacob's favorite part was the bubbles. Did you like the bubbles? Tomorrow is the 1st of December, so it's the start of our Christmas traditions, even though we're having flexible expectations about our Christmas traditions and they don't necessarily have to work out every single day. The biggest piece of advice I would give you guys is to make your expectations flexible because I don't like saying lower your expectations, but don't have those such high expectations of all the Christmas traditions and things because you're just gonna be let down and you're gonna stress out the family and especially your kids. We're gonna do a loose tradition of an advent calendar. Last year, Jacob opened the entire advent calendar in one day, so we'll see how it goes this year. Um, and also the elf is coming, so I'll see you guys in. Bye! Bye. Good job! Bye.